holy crap, there's entirely too many buttons to push. And I had, <laughs> holy moly, wait a minute. I'm, I'm playing with my adjusting the volume and all that fun stuff. And let's see, how's that better? Is that better? Okay, I'm not blasting your ears out. Whoo! Okay, hey, guess what, everybody? <laughs> this is Grammy Mary, and you are listening to Grammy's Rocket Chair here on this wacka 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 doodle Wednesday. And yeah, yeah, I'm playing with buttons. Because <laughs> I do that so well, don't you know? Holy shit, I still got that. I got my sound card open so that I can sit here and, and dodge with things just a bit. And let's turn that down. Okay, is that any better? Oh, yeah, much better. I'm not... Wow. Ooh. <laughs> so, did I blast you out? I had... Oh, man, I had things so screwed up. But that's okay. <laughs> Because I, yeah, you see everything but grams. Where is she on the page? I'm here somewhere. Um, actually, all you do, hon, is just click the, uh, yeah, as if you can hear. <laughs> I am such a tart sometimes. It's like, yeah, I'm telling people how to do this while they can't listen. <laughs> oh, Road Dog, did you find me? Um... <laughs> Let me make sure everything's, yep, it's broadcasting. See, I think I finally figured out what the hell, what the hell was my problem with Spreaker and all that other fun shit. Let me go before I get to saying, hey there, hi there, ho there to everybody. Come on, don't do that shit to me. I need to mute a few things so that I don't get a whole bunch of ding-dings. <laughs> As if I'm not a big enough ding a ling. So, hi, uh, okay. Uh, yeah, I played that, by the way, I played that song for a reason. Oh, <laughs> uh, I got to drive home in a toad floater today. So, and a toad floater for those of you that. Uh, Okay, you went to tune in? Oh, okay. Yeah, am I really, really loud? <laughs> I'm like, wah! <laughs> oh, it's a good thing you guys ain't paying for this shit. <laughs> That's just all there is to it. Okay, over here on that effing site, that wonderful effing site where all those beautiful effing people are at, that Freedoms Network, I see the lovely T.D. Sanders. I also see Grimner, who is the god over here because he does all of the geekalicious stuff or the nerdalicious however you wish to say that i also see the lovely miri b is over here and uh, yours truly is also over here because if i wasn't over here i wouldn't be able to see all these other people over here don't you know so <laughs> Also, over on Fakey Book, I may as well get this shit done while I'm at it. I have been giving my lovely sister over there in Ireland a healthy dose of shit because she shared a picture of her with, she says it's a mud mask. <laughs> I think she got shit faced, but she says it's a mud mask. Uh huh. That's her story. She's sticking to it. And that's okay. Rascal, honey, I do not need your tail in my face. Thank you very much, little girly. And please do not chew on the cord. That's my leash. Okay, that's my key cat, by the way. <laughs> she's always got to help. Because she's kind of silly like that. Okay, I got to see who else is giving her shit. Oh, there you go. Everybody's giving her shit now because, well, it looks like she's shit-faced. So, okay. I got Catherine over here. I got the lovely Miri B over here. I also got Gary L over here. Who else do I have over here? I'm busy looking and laughing. And hi, Christopher and Patrick. How are you guys doing this evening? Um, oh, and Charlotte is here. Hey there, Charlotte. How are you doing this evening? I hope you're doing absolutely splendiferous on this wacka 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 doodle Wednesday. I also see Sadja then. Sadja then. Who is, I know who Sadja then is. 
he <laughs> and darlin i hope you're recuperating just fine i i know how that abdominal surgery shit goes and it's not fun at all rather painful actually if you wish to know even if you don't wish to know i'm gonna share it with you okay now i'm gonna come over here uh oh okay nerdorama oh there you go grimmy is a nerdorama like a ramadama ding dong or a ramalama ding dong or a nerdorama ding dong <laughs> or a something let's see how about grammy lammy ding dong that's what i am so there okay um da, 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 da. let me see who do i have over here in the rlm yeah instead of trying to sing at you and making y'all go holy shit i wish she'd quit ha <laughs> oh look the world's biggest bottled water brand admits it's just tap water really no shit sherlock huh i'd have never guessed it yeah, you'd be surprised. Your tap water is probably cleaner than a hell of a lot of that bottled water is. Just putting that out there. I know mine is because I'm on well water. Yeah, I'm spoiled. I'm bragging. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And it's ever so tasty. And speaking of water, I think I will have just a little swig. Mmm. <laughs> nom, 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 nom. Okay. Yeah, I had someone tell me earlier today, fuck water. And it's, uh, by the way, a bomb 10 minutes in. Um, and I looked at him and one of my coworkers said, do what? And I said, well, fish do. And neither one of them got it. It's like, what? All right, guys. You're a little slow on the uptake, ain't ya? That's okay. I'll let you be. Yeah. Uh, okay. Back to saying hi. I got to shut off this so real fast just because i no longer need it because i've got my level figured out no i'm not on the level i'm just playing with levelers grammy palooza woo woo hey carl how you doing sweetheart welcome aboard now all i need is to have costin show up and then it would be like Booyah! And it would be even better if Costin had an article for me to read because I love reading Costin stuff. But since he's not here and since I don't have an article, I guess I'll just start at the top. Shall we? Asmo, my missionary man, how you doing, darling? I hope you're having an absolutely splendiferous day. Probably saw on a few logs, though, right about now, aren't you? I'm thinking, don't you work graveyard shift? I used to work graveyard shift, kind of sucked. But, you know, once I got used to it, it was cool until they shifted the schedule around and I wasn't on graveyard shift anymore. Talk about messing with your head. Hoy. That's kind of hard to get used to all them different shifts. But, what the hell? I'm, I'm shifting. I'm, see, even way back then, I was shifting. I was shifting. Shifting to the left, shifting to the right, and you know what? <laughs> Y'all can't see this, but I shifted to the right when I said shift into, uh, never mind. Okay, saying hi. Hi, Vinny. Are you high? <laughs> Do you have a tether on your ankle? Just in case you kind of start getting away from things. I'm curious. Okay, back to saying hey. Barman, you are the most splendiferous bot in the whole wide world. Um... Oh, in beer, there is purity, clarity, and certainty of measure. In water, there is bacteria. Ben Franklin. <laughs> in heaven, there is no beer. That's why I would drink it here. Okay, move along. Cut it out. Beth A. How you doing, Beth? I hope you're having an awesome day today. I'm sure it's getting to be dark 30 in your neck of the woods. It's starting to be kind of sort of dark 30 out here because, yeah, it's soggy. It's very soggy. And my rain gauge is lying to me. I think my rain gauge was playing dodge rain or dodge drops because it only caught a half an inch. And I got puddles in my yard that are deeper than a half an inch right now. It's like, are you kidding me? I don't think so. So, <clears throat> moving along. Grimmy! Grimmy is the nerdorama. You can't find Grams? I'm here. I'm here. 
I feel like a who in Whoville. We're here. We're here. Hold you by the tether, Vinny? <laughs> That's just a short leash, hun. <laughs> Moving along. Okay. Yeah, Grammy, I know a lot of people that are having trouble with that RLM.XYZ page. I don't know why, but they are. Um, cool beans, Alexander Haig. Uh, Alexander Haig, you know, me, you and me, we have to have a talk. <laughs> Oh, you're resting up from, oh, okay. Well, that's good. You know, resting up is good. I like resting up. Hmm. Of course, I like resting down as well, but I like, lo never mind. Moving along. Grimmy. Yeah, the Ramalama Ding Dong. Nerdorama dude. He is the god of RLM. Um. <laughs> Grim, did you have a magnifying glass and tweezers? Inquiring minds want to know. Or maybe not. Okay, moving along. Moose Girl! Hey, Moosey! How you doing, girlfriend? I finally got to see that link that you shared on my wall over on Facebook. Freaking thing hid it from me. I had to unhide it. I had to go into my little notifications and yada, yada, yada. It's like three or four steps. And then I finally found it, and it was like, unhide. Anything Moosey shares on my wall, unhide. Trouble? Who's trouble? I'm not having trouble. Are you having trouble? Oh, I don't I don't know, Grim, but I know a lot of people. And when I try and post it over on Fakie Book, it makes me go through all of these hoops and shit. Because it says, are you sure you want to post that? Are you sure that's not a robot? Yada, 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 yada. So I have to do that CAPTCHA bullshit stuff. And it's like, what the hell? What the hell? So I don't, I don't know if Fakie Book just doesn't recognize it or what. But it's, duh. Okay, moving along. You'll read to, okay. I'm trying to keep up with the chat too, and it's like I'm starting to, to develop Marty Feldman eyes. That's not a good thing. <laughs> it's not a look that I was really going for, you know? Okay, Moosey, hi. I'm saying it again. The lovely Kate. How's things down in Texas, Kate? I hope they're not too sweltering. Um, I also see trust. No one. Shh. You know, every time I do that, Shh. I think somebody sprung a leak. Or maybe I did. <gasps> Moving along. Hi, Chalcedoni. How you doing, sweetheart? You know, you're still being very silent, but not completely silent. Um. Oh, okay. Cool beans, Beth, eh? I'm glad. Yay! Yeah. Yeah, over on that fascist book. Yeah. I do get an awful, I, I do an awful lot of trolling over there. <laughs> okay, it's not really, well, okay, yeah, maybe it is. Because I call people out on their bullshit. So maybe that is trolling. I don't know. And yeah, Beth, it could be on their end. Um, CAPTCHA is teaching AI to read. Well, obviously AI is having a lot of difficulty. <laughs> I know, Grimmy. Okay, moving along. <clears throat> Chloe! Hi, Chloe. You're here twice. Cool. There's a double dose of Chloe. It's like Chloe and her evil twin. Oh, this could be fun. Yay. I also see Ibi Don C is here as well as Ibi Don C work. Hey there, darling. How you doing? The double dose of Ibi Don C as well. See? Double your pleasure. Double your fun. Double mint. Double mint. Double mint gum. Okay. Java. Oh, hey. Good Lord Almighty. We are really double dipping here. I got Java, 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 Java Doctor and Java, 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 Java Doctor 2. The new and improved version. So, see, really got a lot of double in your pleasure and double in your fun. And obviously, double uh, Java Doctor did that because he's got a new Bambino. <laughs> Moving along. <clears throat> Hi, Wanna Taco. That sounds really good. It really does. I haven't had supper yet. Unfortunately. Oh, wait. 
Oh, wait. I do have some burritos frozen yet. Hey, and I have, I have some restaurante-style salsa as well. So, yeehaw. This is good. Oh, that'll be after the radio. Because I'm not going to do that while I'm on the radio. Because I don't think y'all want to hear me going. <laughs> <laughs> Although I just inflicted that on you. Wasn't that swell of me? I know, it wasn't. Okay. Um, P. Bunyan. Timber. I heard you was getting rained on, sweetie. Was that just yesterday or is that today as well? I want to know. Rob Works is here. Hey, sweetie, where's the bubbler? Tiny bubbles in the bong really make me feel happy. <laughs> Hi, Vinny. How you doing, sweetie? I know you've been having some troubles with your radio stuff, too, but hey, you know what? You'll get it figured out, and Alexander Haig is back. He's back back oh man you know today is going to be one of those obscure reference kind of nights i'm just just warning you right now as if you hadn't already noticed that alias is here hey darling how's things going down under oh you know i i watched a video the other day that um you know talking about the music industry and how much the illuminati has infested it as shocker Really? As if you couldn't tell by the shit music that's coming out lately? Uh-huh. Although, you know, he's even accusing all of the really cool stoner music from back when I was a kid. And a stoner. <laughs> Maybe that's why I really liked it. Because I was stoned and I'd, I just kind of was like, dude. Although I still enjoy it. So... Arriba! Trump went to Mexico today. Yeah, he flew his copper copter so he could go helicopter, helicopter, helicopter. But he flew his helicopter so that he could fly low and check out the cartel. <laughs> you know, he's got to see what the hell is, is uh, paying the bills for the CIA and the NSA and the DEA and all them freaking alphabet supergates. Yep. Um... Okay. You hope he gets snatch? I think I think Trumple Silskin gets plenty. Oh, you are high? Okay, good deal, Vinny. Moving along. Let's see. Where was I at? Wait a minute. I said Vinny. And Alexander Haig. Yeah, he's back for more. <laughs> and uh, alias. Yeah, I did say alias. There's that other dose of Chloe. Woo woo! party Meister bra i see you you're you're up there so i missed you because you just showed up damn it you're late young man and there's going to be a test at the end don't you know okay everyone is alex really <laughs> i'll take only things that i know for 1000 alex and i'll probably still get it wrong <laughs> Oh, meanwhile, black, back at the ranch, Lone Ranger and Tonto were putting up a brick wall, and then Tonto plastered his crack. Ew! Moving along. I'm here, and I am making obscure references this evening. Some of them are so obscure that even I go, What? Did I really say that? <laughs> you did. I see Carl is over here. Hey there, Carl. How you doing? I've left you alone so far. That, that, yeah, give me time and I'll pick on you as well. And looky there. The lovely Mary B is over here. My lovely sister from another mother down under. Yes, I love Mary B. She's so freaking awesome. And to round out the crew, the one, the only, the guy that calls everybody Alex because it's a hell of a lot easier than trying to remember your name. Hi, Road Dog. How you doing, sweetie? See, I call everybody sweetie or hon or toots or darling or wait. <laughs> Whoa, I have lots of names for people. <laughs> Some of them get the really quality names like Butt Munch or Turdmeister or, yeah, I can I can get real creative if you want me to. Auto! Is that autopilot? Okay, 
Meister Brower says, I got an issue with my need to set up a new directory for my chain data. Oh, that's Bitcoin stuff. I don't understand that. I'm not going to go there. I understand there's a lot of people that are making some money at it. You know, and that's all well and good and cool and, and yeah. But I'm thinking, okay, the dollar bill is already fiat currency. It's already fake a shit. And they already, all they have to do is with the push of a button, ta-da, you have money. It's magic. Fuck you. Oops, it's the first lady. What, what, what? What's that, hun? I'm going to copy that link in. Oh, hick burp, cha-cha-cha. Wow. How often does water give you the burps? <laughs> well, it's just me you're talking about. I... What is that? Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's a shart attack, hun. Never trust a fart. Especially when you've been eating things that have been made with olestra. Just saying. <laughs> and yeah. Oh, look. Shart! I'm thinking, Java, that that just means that um, she, well, you know, she's over full and it's starting to seep. Somebody needs to just poke her. <laughs> Although, if you really want to see a shit storm, poker. Ugh. Okay. Automatically. Wow. How fun is that? <laughs> Y'all are very clever today. I'm proud of you. Yay. Oh, and Trump will get us a job in an, in an air conditioner factory. Hey, you know what? My, um, one of my brothers, I have seven of them, so, you know, pick a brother, any brother. In any case, uh, <laughs> Bitcoin is like farm bill credits. Oh, yippee Well, thank you, no. Um, squirrel, I have a brother that um, went down to Mexico twice to help train people on a piece of equipment down there. They were learning how to use a baler. Um and basically they were constructing the baler but they had to learn how to use it first in order to understand how it operates which makes sense to me so he's he's running through this with them and and he can i mean this has been several years back and he can still cuss fluently in hispanic to me which is fine because it really sounds weird because he's got that dutchy hayes accent i'm from hayes america yeah, he talks like this. I need to find that article so I can read it to you. Tim der German, Volker Germans down there in Ellis County. Yeah. In any case, you, ha you have that kind of accent and speaking Spanish. It's funnier than hell. <laughs> Trust me, it is. In any case, he was, he was teaching them how to do this Baylor thing. And the first time he let them do a dry run on their own, they went through a whole spool of baling twine and they asked if that was normal. And he kind of looked at them and he looked at the bale and he looked at them and then he just started laughing. And he said, no, you're not supposed to do it like that. That, that baling twine is only supposed to go on the last, not start at the very beginning and do it all the way through, <laughs> which is what they did. So, <clears throat> Rather interesting. Yeah, you get what you pay for there, peeps. You pay shit wages. Odds are. And then again, this is free. <laughs> You're getting what you pay for. Just saying. Okay. Mm. Now that I have giggled and ranted and raved and all that other fun stuff. Oh, it's been a lovely day out here in Booneyville, by the way. Just to let you know, I got I got a phone call from my insurance agent earlier today, and he said that uh, he wanted to know if he'd come over and look at the roof of my house in town because um, he said your insurance rates really, really are just too high for a single family dwelling, which I said, uh, yeah, I noticed that. I saw that it, yeah, insurance, my homeowner's insurance, which I have not made a claim on in like five years six longer than that seven years seven years was the last claim and that was for redoing the roof over the garage but um my insurance 
went up $700 a year. And it's like, holy mackinoli. Why the hell? And he thought that that was excessive as well. So he wanted to go over and look at my house, take pictures of the roof, and get me with a different company that would be a hell of a lot cheaper, which I'm thinking, cool beans. So I told him, yeah, go over, take pictures. He called me back about an hour and a half later, and he says, your roof, uh, yeah, is totaled. And I went, what? <laughs> what? What are you talking about, Willis? Yeah, that last hailstorm that came through. Uh, Mames and James, which, you know, they don't really tell me about a lot of that stuff because they just fix it because they're wonderful renters and James likes doing that kind of stuff and he does it for a living and, and he's very sweet and he charges me for materials, but doesn't charge me for labor because I feed him and Amy and I supply them with oils. So, you know, in any case, it works, it works. But, uh, yeah, that last hailstorm that came through totaled out my roof. So... On the bad side, it's like, okay, sons of bitches, you raised my rates. I'm going to make a claim on you. So there, sod ya. And uh, then, after I make a claim and, and, and I get my roof replaced, which uh, James and Amy and I and, and Amy's uncle and a couple other friends will probably do all of the labor on it. So, um, or not. I don't know. It depends on, on how we figure this shit out. But... Um, so I'll get a new roof and then I'll get a new insurance company. One that's not charging me out the yin yang. Even though I have not made a claim. Sons of bitches. It's a racket. It really is. But you know, if there's an issue, I really would not want to be out that much money. Cause that's an awful lot of money. That house is worth a lot of money. And I would just as soon Amy and James just go ahead and say, okay, we're buying it from you. Cause that would be really cool. That would be really cool so that I could buy this place and I don't have to worry about it anymore. I would be like Booyah City. But moving along. So, yeah, got all that fun shit going along. And then right after I find out about that, here comes a toad floater. <laughs> so it's like, please don't leak. Please. Oh, Mother Nature has a warped sense of humor. Have you noticed that? I have. I think she's rather demented at times. But, let's see. And speaking of demented, I'm looking in my pocket right now, and I'm seeing some things that I shoved in there earlier today and over the last few days. Um, and I see all kinds of lovely things, you know, like a, a Jewish person that wants to boycott Israel. Um, let's see. Dying scientists. How to kill spiders, which I know how to kill spiders. Uh, newspaper or jab flap or flip-flop, or thong, whatever you wish to call it. Um, let's see. Or the solar village that's the world's first community to produce four times more energy than it uses. I will get to that one here in just a little bit. But the one that I want to get to first, first, and then I will get to one that has local uh, ties again because I'm not going to let that one die. I'm just not. I'm going to stay after their asses, and so are an awful lot of people out here. But first, just to let you know how messed up the world is. Totally and completely fee-buddled and fucked. Or the new four-letter F word that I'm going to start using, it's Ford. Found on road dead. All you Ford drivers, nanner, nanner, nanner. I work at a Chevy dealership, so there. <laughs> Pays the bills. Okay, this is from naturalblaze.com. Judge gives cancer patient 90 days of jail for being too sick to pay bills. Like, that's going to help them pay the bills. Alrighty then. Talk about a bass awkward world. Wee! Yeah, Judge Milas. Butch Hale of Sherwood, Arkansas, or Arkansas. Why is it Arkansas when it's Kansas? And yet it's the Arkansas River. That, that, huh? Just putting that R on front, that piratey thing on front changes the whole pronunciation. Is that how, Vinny, is that how that works? You put a pirate on the front and all of a sudden the pronunciation changes from Kansas to Arkansas. You completely lost that last S, turned it into a W. 
In any case, this guy hails from Sherwood, Arkansas. Arkansas. And, um, let's see. He's been accused of allegedly, allegedly, <laughs> I love how, yeah, put him on a ledge and then put a banana peel like right there and let's see how long he can last. Who's taking bets? In any case, he's running a modern day debtor's prison. Um, or he's been accused of that after he recently sentenced a 44-year-old man with pancreatic cancer to 90 days in jail. Well, you just gave him a death sentence, bitch. Biatch. President and executive director of the Lawyers Committee for Civil Rights Under Law. That's a mouthful and a half. This was Christine Clark. Why don't you just say Christine, who's a lawyer, and she's, she's a highfaluter one. She said, um, said, let's see, of sentencing people like this to jail, here is her quote, people are doomed for failure when they appear before the court and most significantly trapped in this never-ending cycle of expanding debt with the resurgence of debtors' prisons. We will continue to see people cycle in and out of jails and prisons across our country merely because of their inability to pay fines and fees tied to...